test the load control system at the start of each shift. Park the unloaded machine on level ground with the engine running. Apply the park brake and place the forward reverse lever in the neutral position. Ensure the boom is fully retracted. Partly raise and extend the boom. The amber ground mode symbol goes off and the green load mode symbol comes on. Drive the machine forwards. The green load mode symbol goes off and the amber ground mode symbol comes on. Stop the machine. The green load mode symbol comes on and the amber ground mode symbol goes off. Press and release the display button. The lights will flash with an audible tone. Operate the boom lower. The boom should not lower. Press and release the display button. The lights will flash with an audible tone. Operate the boom extend. The boom should not extend. Press and release the display button. The lights will flash with an audible tone. Operate the boom lift. The boom should lift. With the boom slightly extended, press and release the display button. The lights will flash with an audible tone. Operate the boom retract. The boom should retract. Select a suitable load, for example a pack of blocks. Make sure the machine is on solid, level ground with the park brake applied. With the stabilizers up, lift the boom so that the load is just clear of the ground. Extend the boom slowly and carefully. Watch the LED progress up the scale. Hydraulic operation should slow and then stop when the amber LED flashes. Some machines may be different depending on the age or model, so always check your operator's manual if you are not sure. Do not use the machine if the unit is faulty. Stop and park the machine as soon as safety permits. Switch off the engine. Contact your JCB distributor. The load motion indicator is fitted for your safety and the safety of others working on site. It ensures the machine is not picking up overweight loads that could cause the machine to fail or cause an accident.